नमस्ते लेडीज एंड जेंटल एज अ पार्ट ऑफ रिक्वेस्ट एंड यू नो वेदर यू से इट एज रिक्वेस्ट वेदर यू से इट एज मोटिवेशन वॉट एवर इट इज वॉट एवर दैट I have been doing so far this video recordings or uh, whatever you say you know I also need certain kind of motivation at first place and secondly I am doing it because I wanted to give it back to the society I also spent lot of time and burn more energy as well just give that small bit of it or the you know, small part you know where you know if you could really think that yes whatever he is telling let's try listening to it and give that small bit of support it could be cash or kind or whatever it is if you can donate small bit of it my channel would be really thankful to you and i would be able to produce much better results it's a request and i also commit mistake and mistakes as well i am also normal human being please do correct if you think that i have committed mistake i am telling wrong at any place please do correct me you can always call me on my phone number 9121379100 this is what is my gpay number as well and the phone pay number also is the same if you see though i am sharing those details with you and in case if you have any suggestions or questions please feel free to send it across to the email address of n a r a d l a r a m a c h a n d r a at the rate yahoo.com or simple smith123846 at the rate gmail.com small part of donation whether it is cash whether it is kind whether it is help or whatever it is will really motivate individuals like me to do videos like this i appreciate your patience i thank again for watching my videos in advance please do like subscribe share stay blessed have a real blissful life may the guru's grace be with all have a nice day ahead
नमस्ते लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन अस्य श्री शुद्ध शक्ति माला महामंत्र से उपस्थ्रियादि वर्ण आदि ऋषि दैवी गायत्री छंद सात्विकट्टारिकपीठस्थित श्रीमत्कामेशरांक निलया श्रीमत्कामेशरी देवता ऐं बीज क्लीं शक्ति सौकीलक श्रीदेवी प्रीतर्थे खड्ग सिद्ध्यर्थे जपे विनियोग गुरूर्ब्रह्म गुरूर्ष्णु गुरूर्देव महेशर गुरूर्साक्षा परम ब्रह्म तस्म श्रीगुरव नम ऐ मंगुष्ठाभ्या नम क्ली तर्जनीभ्या नम सौ मध्यमाभ्या नम सौ अनामिकाभ्या नम क्ली कनिष्ठकाभ्या नम ऐं करतलकृष्ठाभ्या नम ऐं हृदयाय नम क्ली शिसे स्वाह सौ शिखा वश्षट सौ कवचा क्ली नेत्रय वौषट ऐमस्त्राय फट भूर्भुवस्वरो इन माय प्रीवियस वीडियो आई वाज टॉकिंग अबाउट द कॉन्शियसनेस इज नॉट लिमिटेड टू टाइम एंड स्पेस एक्शंस एंड एक्सपीरियंसेस आर रिफ्लेक्शंस ऑफ सेल्फ इमेज transformation begins at conscious level two visions earthly and spiritual now let's get much further to understand what is it that really is this earthly vision see i was talking about antarmukha samaradhya bahirmukha sudurlabha of lalita sahasranama what really happens during uh, antarmukha sadhana during antarmukha sadhana this body is directly or indirectly connected to that uh, higher cosmic energy level that is cosmic consciousness or center of consciousness or that unity with the whole and the transcendency level in the sense this body is mixture of mix and match of whole of the multiverse this body represents whole of it point number 1 point number 2 this intuitive nature it gives rise to that intuition deep within which happens from the adya chakra here which gives rise to thoughts as a whole now how do you feel that what is this sir? you know uh, earthly vision which i am which earthly vision visions that i am talking about the earthly visions that i am talking about is that thing which you experience during your योग मित्रावस्था और मित्रावस्था अंडरस्टैंड इट कैनॉट कम एट वन शॉट 
but uh, you will have to experience this again i am telling you as an experiencer and experiencing and that complex study of your time and space travel which happens during which these saptaswaras which i am talking about which are having that uh, you know um, uh, converting uh, uh, conversion of this uh, frequencies modulators and demodulators sa pa tha tha pa tha pa tha pa tha ni dha ni sa pa sa pa sa pa tha 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 ni dha ni sa pa sa pa sa pa sa pa tha ni sa sa re ga re ga re ga sa re ga re ga ma pa tha ma pa tha ma pa tha ni dha ni sa what is that i am trying to do by enunciating and pronunciating i am actually like using the saptaswaras as modulators and demodulators from bahirmukha you know imagining that this is what is there you may have uh, this is what i need from the earthly existence which are both real and unreal in nature the concept of uh, reality and unreality starts happening the very concept of unreality and reality concept think about it ladies and gentlemen that is a reason why today there are many studies happening uh, at a conscious level and there are many studies happening at a neurological level and there are many studies happening at a spirituality and philosophical level there are many tarka the 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 tarka and vitarka aspect also is coming into picture but none of us could come to a conclusion that you know this is right and this is wrong why this uh, you know uh, 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 why this thing happened which not every one of us know actually you will come to know when you are able to you know transcribe the modulators and demodulators uh, so uh, uh, modulators in reference to saptaswaras who are acting as demod modulators and demodulators and creating that self image and thus experiencing and uh, working as an experience are as well is what is the true definition of earthly existence of the when you are able to understand this very concept at earthly level that is at a transcendental state of mind then going much further at this level at this level this is the juncture wherein 
you will be able to understand that spirituality concept that spiritual connection of the human existence between human existence and that uh, you know cosmic consciousness level again how you understand this yoga drashta yoga drashya yuga drashta yuga drashya if you are able to differentiate between yoga maya and yuga maya maya and maha maya and if you are able to differentiate between real and unreal aspect of the human existence it's a very complex study ladies and gentlemen these two visions if you are able to actually like understand and correlate and you are able to come in confluence with or in convergence with let me tell you you are one more maharshi and that is the reason why if you really see the if you go to as i said earlier right i have experienced in shirdi and uh, shirdi sai baba's temple and uh, dwarka mai in dwarka mai and uh, ravana maharshi tiruvannamalai and uh, this uh, instant i have been to shankaracharya's math also in kerala i have experienced this i could understand this uh, differentiation of uh, what exactly this earthly existence at earthly existence what it happens and at spirituality level what it happens what my body is and this is exactly why this natya shastra was also introduced unfortunately ladies and gentlemen <coughs> sorry about that ladies and gentlemen we may be i don't know that it, it is my perception as an individual dancer is not able to get to understand this this is what i am feeling this differentiation of earthly existence and the spirituality existence and that cross reference of both uh, earthly and spiritual uh, existence and that is the reason why not everyone are able to generate that positive energy at least i have never seen because i have been to many concerts but uh, unfortunately i did not see i could see maybe one or two where in that energy was emitted and i could feel that and that is a primary purpose for natya shastra it is not only for that enjoyment purpose those one or eight karnas or that uh, those mutras have that direct link that directly connection which helps us connect get connected to that uh, from earthly existence to that spiritual existence they work in parallel both in tandem though it is like i wouldn't say hard but uh, you know one really needs to get into the very aspect of the word existence word or that uh, you know uh, shabda bheda and shabda prakarana aspect
that alphabets exist in again again it is leading to science of sound again listen <laughs> it's a very like you know this is the complexity of the human brain actually end of the day our human brain which has 65 billion neurons which gets us connected to that 100 billion galaxies in the multiverse at a cosmic consciousness only then you would be able to understand this very concept of uh, earthly and spirituality existence not before that unfortunately think about it ladies and gentlemen it is a research point also actually not really every one of us really are able to you know could find any references to this hard driving concept that's okay at a minuscule level uh, not everyone of us ravana maharshi is right not everyone of us are uh, shirdi sai baba not everyone of us are shankaracharya not everyone of us are realized souls if we are able to differentiate between these two visions and if we are able to get that connection established between earthly you know that uh, earthly vision and spiritual vision there is nothing like it that peace and harmony would always be there that peace and harmony would always be there and if we are able to understand that true nature of the femininity again i am telling you don't uh you know but try to understand the true meaning of femininity true definition of feminine nature and true definition of mother goddess that lalita tripura sundari tattva again if you are able to understand that if you are able to see mother goddess face to face eye to eye contact and if you are able to feel that supreme bliss of mother goddess end you as individual during meditation you would be able to differentiate between that earthly existence and spiritual existence and start working out that is where the sadhana lies and this is the sadhana that natya shastra says talks about whether it is bharatnatyam whether it is kuchpudi whether it is mohini attam whether it is any kind of it's not so easy to establish that connection ladies and gentlemen even that sattaswaras if you really want to get into that uh, mode what happens is you will have to get into that intricate aspect of to understand these two visions and establish that connection when you are able to establish this connection of earthly existence and spiritual existence in your mind which has 65 billion neurons and 
that to that galaxy of hundred uh, billion, hundred billion galaxies in the multiverse. It's always and there by uh, and in fact this is the point of research as the data center. Think about it. Thus I conclude this video with a positive note. Stay blessed. Have a real blissful life. May the Guru's grace be with all. Have a nice day.